The Window Labels and Buyer's Guide is one of the services that sets Cardia apart from the competition. We strive to give our clients all the tools needed for their automotive marketing needs. In this video, I will go over the sticker tab and show you how to use it. The window labels and buyer's guides are necessary for all used vehicles. If you take photos of a vehicle, it must have window stickers and buyer's guides, no exception guides. Being organized will eliminate most issues we hear from our reps in the field. I ran out of labels. Well, keep track of your inventory. When you start running low, just place your order. You can order labels by emailing support at cardata.us. I ran out of toner. If you have a 6200 or a 5700, it should roughly give you around 4,000 prints. Another way to know is when your ink starts fading away and it will be visible on your labels. Depending on the vehicle, please select the appropriate label. Remember, a Toyota Tacoma can only get certified at a Toyota dealership. Let's talk about window labels. In the window label drop down menu, you will have up to several options, but most of the time you will see the dealership's name certified and the dealership's name Bell. For example, Acura of Carland certified Vell, Acura of Carland Vell. Certified goes obviously with the certified and the Carland regular one goes with the regular buyer's guide. If your car is as is, then you will get Acura Carland Bell. Now, if your car is down to factory, you will also get Acura Carland Bell unless specified by the dealership. Remember, this is dealership specific. So always verify with the manager of that dealership. And if you're uncertain, call a car data manager and verify. Don't ever just guess. It's better for you to ask the first time, get the answer right. You don't have to go back to it, all right? The Buyer's Guide. It's a legal document that must be on every vehicle in the front line that is processed and ready for sale. That drop down menu will also give you several options. Certified, as is, and balance of factory. And you will also see the Z back. Remember in the general tab, I gave you guys a link to download to your phone as a reference? Well, this is where that link comes in handy. Let me give you an example. A 2018 Acura MDX with 49,000 miles will be a balance of factory sticker, but a 2018 Acura MDX with 50,001 mile will no longer be a balance of factory. It will be an as is, unless a dealer has certified that car, then you can put a certified sticker on it. Note, all buyer's guide will have that as is check marked. You need to read the fine print at the bottom. The buyer's guide takes it a step further by adding what we call a Z back which is the additional information printed on the back of each buyer's guide. It is not an option. All buyer's guides should have information on both sides with no exception. The fine for not having a buyer's guide on a used vehicle is up to $12,000. That's a pretty hefty fine if you ask me. So please, make sure you label all your cars appropriately, including walk in the front line, catch any missing labels on that lot. That's the time you can charge for a reprint. The reprint covers both window labels and buyer's guide, but if only one is missing, we still charge the price that is included on your phone. Take your time so you only have to do it once and not have to redo any of this. Printing labels in the hot sun can be cumbersome. So the faster you print, the more time you save, and that means more money in your pocket. And again, guys, as usual, if you have any questions, please let me know.